What up, what up, what up, what up? Y'all already know, man. We got you for another upload on the channel. You know, we the ones right here consistently filling y'all in, man. Sharing some rare lives and breaking news and updates with what's going on in the trenches. You know, you get it here with us, man. So give us a little appreciation by clicking that like button real quick. Thumbs up, paint it blue. And we're going to keep on doing this for you. Because at the end, that's who we do it for, man. We're here for you guys to tune in and enjoy. So y'all already know if y'all already did that salute salute to you being real and let's get to this one we over here we over here and O block man parkway gardens long live king Vaughn. but it seems like something is starting to change in the O block community man a lot of these new savages from out there in O block man especially the youngins man seems like they like to crack the trays now isn't cracking the trays a disrespect to BD, BDN? So, these youngins in O-Block are now so BDK. Oh, you a thug again. So, uh, y'all already know it's kind of confusing because a lot of the drill fans are saying if King Bond was still alive, these guys would not be goofing around doing that, bro. You would not be cracking trays, dissing the BDN, dissing King David, and dissing pretty much all the other fallen members from O Block that died because they was part of being black disciples. So what's up with this whole BDK now with these youngins? Hey, hey, boy. 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 Hey, that's still my name. Hey, so, hey, hey. Fuck this shit, man. Hey, bud, where the fuck you at, man? You always miss shit, shit bro. You always miss shit, gang. But, hey. I see, I need to get my shit done. Hold on, my So there y'all see that man pretty much thinking it's funny and silly to do the whole cracking trays. That is crazy, man. Back in 2011, 2012, when drill scene started, if you was doing that, that meant you was really JoJo World or you was really, really BDK. Like, you does not rock with any BDs. But I thought Parkway Gardens was always full and affiliated with Black Disciples. Probably is true, man. King Von was here, still alive. These kids would not be, you know, horsing around like this. So y'all go ahead and let me know in the comment section, man. Have y'all seen this before? And how do you feel this is right? And why would be the reason? I know they could be renegades now, I guess, where they don't hang out and don't respect other BD blocks like Front Street and such on. But uh, I don't know, man. It's a real big twist from 2011 to 2024. RIP to all the real members that fell behind this whole BDN throwing up the three and now you got your own neighborhood youngins disrespecting for what you fell for and speaking on the fallen since today is memorial day i guess taste celebrates his memorial day a little different man when it comes to memorial day he's not really celebrating the memorial for the you know the troops and the military it's more his troops his fallen members, his fallen soldiers, his fallen brothers from the trenches, from 
O Block 600, such a man. So he speaks and he says yesterday, man, he was getting a little emotional after seeing, you know, some pictures that were roaming around, man, in Instagram and YouTube of some of his 600 members, man. He says he remembers exactly when they took those pictures and they was together, man. He remembers like it was just yesterday, man. A lot of the pictures included, you know, Tay 600 seen right next with Ali Capone, King Von, some little bull D thing, man. Uh, there's pictures of Tay 600, and so there's a picture, man, that's roaming around, man, where you can see T Slick and D thing and such a man all be in this picture. And unfortunately, it's like five different members, and they're all fallen, man. They're all gone. They've all passed on, and I guess that is the type of pictures that you know kind of make someone that knew these people kind of sad that each and every one of your friends in this picture they're all gone man you say today i went la capone crazy on my page hey look i swear to god look y'all yesterday i was in my feelings about a lot of my dead homies and shit and the ones that's book i swear to god all the pages that keep my homies alive for I love y'all for on Steve folk because people that was in their lives every day forget about folks now. So I like to see people just give folk them the appreciation they deserve for like if I could if I could talk and, and post about my own niggas every day without running off half of my followers and shit just because I post too much I probably would. Y'all know them was my homies for real folk when I be seeing them. So There you have it, man. Tay 600 announcing he was kind of emotional yesterday, man, knowing that Memorial Day was going to be the next day. And, you know, when he thinks about soldiers that's been fallen in this war, man, he thinks about his soldiers, man, his brothers. So long live all the guys, man. RIP to everyone that lost their life in this ridiculous nonsense that, you know, back and forth violence in Chicago. Through the whole drill scene, through the whole streets, and through... You know, so much things have happened. So many people have fallen. So this is the way they do their memorial over there in Chirac. Shout out to Tay 600, man. Sharing that with us, man. Keeping it true with the fans. Y'all already know we're going to keep you guys posted up with more and more content. If you haven't seen my latest upload, man, wait for the end screens right now so you can pick one or the other. These are the latest ones that's going around right now through YouTube. And it's the latest updates on what's going on with some of these 600 members as well, including Mimo 600. And another one was Quando Rondo this in Chicago. Go check out those two, man. They're going to come out in the end screen right about now.